Hello viewers, I am Ridula and welcome back to my cookbook channel. Winter has arrived and all we need is a bowl of hot soup. So in this video, I am going to show you how to make a simple sweet corn soup. So let's see what we need for this. I have taken 1 cup of boiled sweet corn. I have boiled this corn in pressure cooker for 2 whistles. 1 small carrot finely chopped. 2 to 3 chopped green beans. 2 large garlic cloves finely chopped. 2 bulbs of spring onion finely chopped and also some green leaves of spring onion for garnishing. Black pepper powder, salt to taste, 1 tablespoon corn flour for thickening the soup and half teaspoon vinegar. This is optional. The most important ingredient for any soup is a good stock. This is my homemade vegetable stock. I have also uploaded a video on this and you can find the link to it in my description box below. If possible, do make this stock. It is very easy to make and it also adds extra flavor to the soup. I am going to use half cup of this stock, half cup of water and 1 tablespoon oil. In a blending jar, add 3 fourth quantity of boiled sweet corn. Rest we will add them in the soup. Grind this into a smooth paste. Then in a pan, heat a tablespoon oil. Once oil turns hot, add finely chopped garlic and spring onion. Saute this for a minute on low flame. Take care not to brown the garlic. Then add chopped carrot and beans. Saute this as well for few seconds. Then add half cup water, put the lid on and cook this for 6 to 8 minutes on medium flame till the veggies are cooked. Now that the veggies are cooked, add boiled corn, the boiled corn paste that we made and vegetable stock. Mix everything well. Add vinegar. Then in a bowl, add corn flour, add some water and mix. Add this to soup and at the same time keep stirring. Add pepper and salt to taste. Simmer this on low flame for a minute. Sweet corn soup is ready. Serve in a bowl and garnish it with chopped spring onion. Do try this recipe and leave your feedback in the comments below. If you like this video then hit the like button, share it with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe. See you next time with a new recipe. Till then take care. Bye bye.